Do you need a new pump for your boiler? You don't want to put boiler extortionate prices that they charge? Well, we've got a Grunfoss replacement here. These pumps will change your life. And I'll quickly show you how. It's as easy as this. So the plan is you go to your boiler. That's your pump in your boiler. That's your faulty pump. You need to change that pump. What do you do? The first thing you do is you get your phone out and you open up the Grunfoss Go app, which is there. Free app, obviously. Once you've opened up, you click on Go Replace and then you scan Grunfoss pump. So literally hold that over your pump and it will scan the uh, data matrix badge, not the QR code. It tells you what you've got, UPM4, recommended pump Alpha 2 Go, and then it'll tell you whether it's full pump or whether it's head only. Head only this one, so then literally follow the instructions. So install your new product, which is what we've done here. So literally four screws, take your head off, put your new head on. This is the Alpha 2 Go, new head. Give the pump power, which is what we've done there. Then click next. And then you connect to it via Bluetooth. So it will find it there or the button. So you press the button on there to connect, or you can press connect on there. Same difference, that's now connecting to the pump. So the phone is connecting to the pump, so it's getting all the data. Now this is a clever bit. Because we've scanned this pump here, we've got all the data on exactly how that pump works for the boiler. And what it's gonna do now is we're gonna replicate, so we're gonna copy that data from there and put it onto there, which is what it's doing now. That is it, that pump has been replicated successful. That pump is now working exactly the same as that one. It's now locked out, you can't do anything to it. That's in the boiler, working the same as that. Job the good and walk away, get your money. You save time, you save money. First time fix, the customer's happy, and it saves you money. Wow, that looks amazing. If you've used one of these, put a comment below, let me know what you think.